Camber, like cutting and hole making, is part of our production line or beam line process. There are two main processes used to induce or reduce camber into steel, and they are cold cambering and cambering using heat. However, cambering using heat nowadays is not as common. Cambering using heat is very labor intensive and takes much longer, where cold cambering can take minutes with a special cambering press or camber pit. Heat cambering could take hours. Cold cambering is when you use force, typically from a hydraulic press, to push on steel. Special camber machines can have two or three rams that push against our steel. When cambering cold, the rams may push or deflect the steel two or three times the amount of the intended camber. While holding that hit or push, the steel undergoes a restructuring at a molecular level. When the rams are retracted, easing off pressure, the beam will then have induced camber, deflection, or simply bend. The way we hit or camber steel depends on the length and size of the steel. 